everyone who is interested in fixed propagation. Today is February 9th, 2023. This is a peak of winter in Israel. The sky is covered with clouds, called by local standards. It often rains, and it's a good time to talk about the winter fixed dormancy. Let's look at this mitralis. It can be seen that the leaves of the figs are practically absent. Let's take a look inside the mesh. This is a bush of a rare local variety Tabali. Almost all the leaves are shed and shoots are dormant. The apical buds sleep and lateral buds also sleep. Let's look at the second bush. This is a rare local variety of Einiki or My Eyes. The same picture of a deeply sleeping plant. The absence of leaves and dormant buds on the shoots. Let's move on to another trellis. Yes, it's the same here. Let's take a look inside the mesh. This is my Brazilian fig bush. It completely shed its leaves and went into dormancy. And this is my bush of a real local variety, Shahmani. He sleeps too. Let's look at the apical bud. It is closed. Let's look at the dormant lateral buds. Leaf buds and fixed buds are sleeping. Everybody sleeps. Let us remember that Shahmani is also in the dormancy stage. This is probably how it should be at this time of the year with all the figs. It should, but it doesn't actually happen. Let's take a look at this pot. This is a young shahmani, grown in the summer from a cutting taken from a large bush that we just saw sleeping. But this young shahmani doesn't sleep. I see young green leaves. I see the open apical bud. But the most interesting, I see fix. Young Shahmani is showing his productivity now in winter in February. These figs grow at every node and increase every day. It doesn't look like the plants are about to drop them. Look at their size. This is impressive. Amazing.
A young shoot grows from the root of young shahmani. And on it I see young figs. Wonderful. Well, maybe this is a feature of the shahmani variety. No, because we have just seen a dormant mother plant of the same variety. And besides, I see another green oasis nearby. These figs have magnificent young green leaves of huge size. There are many times the size of my hand. This is a black bursa variety from the Kirill Donovs collection. This Turkish variety from the Smyrna group is world famous for its excellent figs, both fresh and dried. And of course, besides the leaves, I see figs here too. Figs form and grow in almost every leaf axle. This size is from a pea to a hazelnut. I am sure that the figs would have continued to form even higher on the shoot. But I pruned it. On other black bursa plants in neighboring pots, the same picture young developing figs. Huge leaves from which I want to make fig tea right now. Well, Let's not digress from the topic winter dormancy of our fix. There are two important questions. The first question, what are the reasons for this phenomenon? And the second question, what are the consequences of this phenomenon? The topic of winter dormancy of figs has long been a subject of discussion. Regarding the reasons, I see that the lack of dormancy is not related to a particular variety and is not related to the weather. I admit that it is associated with a violation of the biological clock in young cuttings rooted this summer and not yet overwintered. The second reason is perhaps the transplantation of rooted cuttings in the fall into big pots with my homemade five components soil mix which contains a lot of nutrients. Perhaps there are some other reasons. As for the consequences, I will watch the plants to see the young fig plants will drop the figs or if they will ripen on the young plants of Shahmane and Black Bursa. It is interesting whether, in this case, the development cycle of the Black Bursa fig can be synchronized with the emergence of the Blastophaga wasp, and whether the absence of winter dormancy will cause the weakening of those of the plants in the future. I also wonder if they will have a dormant period next winter. That's all. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and together we will watch the growth and ripening of wonderful Israeli figs.